Rumor has it that a lot of you stuck inside during COVID are cleaning out your closet. Is there an easy way to donate to charity during COVID? In the Atlanta area? There is. That's what we'll talk about next. Hi, I'm Kelly Vandiver. I'm a real estate agent here in the Alpharetta, Georgia area with Keller Williams, North Atlanta. Last month, uh, my stepmother passed away. I know. It sucks. It was during the whole lockdown and everything. But I helped my dad pack up her clothes, not knowing if I'd be able to donate them to charity or what. It just so happened that a charitable organization left a pink bag and a card at my house, and I was able to contact them and make arrangements. But you don't have to wait for somebody to leave a pink bag for you. I've included a link in the comments to the website, Clothing Pickup atl.com. You can go to the site and schedule your charitable pickup. They also have a text option, which I've put below too. You just have to set out your bag, or in our case, boxes, the night before, and they will come by, pick them up, and leave you a receipt. Okay, just to be clear, I know there's a lot of alcohol boxes in that image. Please don't call us. There's no need to do an intervention. Uh, a family member once told us that a great way to move things when you're on a budget is to use boxes from a liquor store. Not only are they free, but they're sturdy because after all, they're made to hold heavy liquor bottles and they're small, so it makes it easier for them to carry. So my family member was so smart, right? A great tip for, for moving things on a budget. Before donating, you might wanna take a look at my video about selling things on Facebook Marketplace. It's super easy. Uh, this particular nonprofit did not take uh, donations of furniture, so that video would definitely be a better resource for you there. Be sure to check the charity's website in advance to see what they'll pick up. In our case, we had some pieces of medical equipment that we left out and they did take them, but I will tell you, they did not take the two bags of hangers, and they say that directly on their website. The nice thing about these donations is they went to Hope for domestic violence, and I know my stepmother would have been really glad to know that they're going to a good cause. So if you're cleaning out your closets and want to make a donation in the Atlanta area, be sure to check out the website that I posted below in the comments, clothingpickupatl.com. And if you have larger furniture items to sell, be sure and check out my video, Selling Things on Facebook Marketplace. I hope you found these tips helpful for making your move easier. <music>